No chance back. Pyle spans back to Wimbledon forever over her insanitary act in front of 400 paying guests. Maggie trembles as Pyle spans her to Wimbledon forever due to her dirty act in front of paying guests. New trends about Meghan Markle at Wimbledon 2019, when she blamed the palace for not protecting her from paparazzi. In 2019, Meghan suddenly appeared on day four of Wimbledon to watch William play in the second round. This is the second time Markle has attended Wimbledon as a royal. She also attended last summer with Princess Kate, a man who was accused of taking photos of her but was actually taking a selfie. Meghan's security forces confronted him, but it was no less an insult than an unjust extension of her power. Other royals don't behave like that. Additionally, Meghan cleared the area around her, even though Kate tried to sit close to others every time she attended. About 40 of Wimbledon's paying guests lost their seats. When Meghan Markle decided to reassure them with her surprise visit, these people may have waited years or come from abroad to attend Wimbledon. There were also rumors about her not being allowed into the royal box because she was wearing jeans. Plus, she watches her friend Serena Williams but doesn't bother staying to watch Andy Murray. She later accused Palace staff of discrimination when they did not gag the media to cover up her bad behavior. As she said in her interview with Oprah, if it were Kate, they would have been told to protect her. Well, Kate has never behaved like Meghan and she knows the royal family has a no complain, no explain policy, so they couldn't care or refute what she said. Therefore, she can freely manipulate public opinion with her propaganda and paint herself as a pitiful victim of the royal family and gain public sympathy. The revelation comes as an expert says Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are not trying hard to make amends with the royal family, despite letting the media know that they are looking at this year as a year of redemption. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex lacked action in their efforts. Royal expert Phil Dampier said Harry and Meghan had made it known that they saw 2024 as the year of redemption, to which his reaction was skepticism. It's a phrase dreamed up by Hollywood PR people, and in reality, it means very little action, speaking louder than words. Phil warns that Harry and Meghan need to do things to convince the public that they want to redeem themselves. He also told Fabulous Magazine that the royal family showed solidarity at Christmas time, with even Prince Andrew's ex-wife, Fergie, being allowed to walk to church and join them for lunch. The message is quite clear. Everyone is welcome, except Harry and Meghan. Prince Harry left the royal family in 2020 with his wife Meghan Markle and son Prince Archie. The couple later accused the royal family of showing discrimination towards their son and publicly shared their grievances on television. Harry and Meghan currently live in Montecito, California.